This is question number five. Uh, we are told simplify 2x squared minus xy minus 6y squared divided by x squared minus 4xy plus 4y squared. You get three marks. Uh, now, for us to be able to do this, uh, this to, we need to factorize the quadratic expressions and then we simplify. So the first one, you see we have x and y, so we consider y as a constant. Uh, once you do that, then you need to get two numbers such that when you add them, you get minus y, which is the coefficient of uh, x, and you, and you multiply 2 times minus 6x squared. So let's start by multiplying 2 multiplied by minus 6y squared, and this should give you uh, minus 12y squared. So you get two numbers so that when you add them, you get minus y. When you multiply them, you get minus 12 squared. These two will be minus 4y and 3y. So we rewrite our expression. We write 2x squared minus, now we have 4xy. Uh, we add to 3xy uh, and you minus 6y squared. Uh, so we can factorize what is common here, and you get 2x, will be left with x minus 2y, uh, then we factor out 3 here, so we have 3 x, 3y, will be left with uh, x minus, uh, this will be 2y, and this will be, uh, we end up with x minus 2y, close a bracket, and we would be left with 2x plus uh, 3y. So these are the factors of the first uh, uh, quadrat the, the numerator, the quadratic uh, expression in the numerator. So we do the same to the other uh, part. So we get uh, the coefficient here is uh, 4y squared. So we get two numbers uh, that when you add them, you get uh, 4y. When you multiply, you get y squared. So this will be 2y and 2y when you multiply minus when you multiply the 2 you get 4y squared when you add you get 4y uh, so we are considering y as a constant so we rewrite this as x squared minus 2xy minus 2xy and this is plus 4y squared uh, so this, uh, you'll be able to factor out x here. You'll be left with x minus 2y. And then here we factor out 2y minus 2y so that we are left with the negative here. So 2y will be left with x minus uh, 2y. So we factor out x minus 2y, which is common. You'll be left with x minus 2y. So because we are now dividing, we can go ahead and now write this. Uh, we will write x minus 2y, uh, that is the numerator, and we have 2x uh, plus uh, 3y, and we are dividing, that is this part here, with x minus 2y, and uh, we have x minus 2y. So you can see this is common. Uh, that means that uh, we will be left with 2x plus 3y and you divide by x minus 2y. So you can, that is the, uh, the last part, that is the farthest you can simplify these two expressions. So that is the answer you get, and that is how you work out such kind of a question. So the important thing here is to know that when you have two unknowns, that is x and y, you need to consider one as a constant so that you are able to factorize uh, the quadratic expressions and simplify.